Now these are just a few baskets that have been collected at uh, Royal LePage Land and Realty and uh, they're all from the Thunder Bay Basketeers. And you may not know what the Thunder Bay Basketeers are or who they are, but I have Darlene Dundas here to explain that. Tell us a little bit about the Thunder Bay Basketeers. So the Thunder Bay Basketeers is uh, in its fourth year. It is uh, actually approximately 12 years old, um, originating in the greater Toronto area. So we're the eighth chapter on board. Uh, and what it is is uh, Rubbermaid baskets filled with goodies that are presented to the women of uh, the women's shelters. Uh, we have two in town, Faye Peterson and Bean again. So upon the deadline date, we invite the, the uh, ladies at the shelter and we distribute them evenly. And they are presented to women that are transitioning out of the women's shelter and, and beginning a life on their own. So they're filled with new items uh, that are going to help them start up uh, and get started in their new life. That's a really great idea. It's amazing. I like looking at some of the stuff here, there's a list on all of them, so all the baskets can be paired up with the right woman. Exactly. And, and, and that's amazing, and, and the basket can be used for laundry. Exactly. <laughs> that, that, you know, Multi-purpose. <laughs> and these are all strictly for women, which is really great, um, because, you know, when some women are going through things like abuse, um, you know, they can be really down, and, and just something like this is a really sweet gesture. Well, I have a little story. Uh, we I received a phone call about a month ago uh, from a lady, and she was asking me about basketeers because so many people don't know what it is or what it's about and so I explained it to her and I had asked her I, do you have a group or you were wanting to uh, adopt a basket and she said well no actually I'm one of the women that did receive a basket and I just didn't know who would do such a nice thing and it made me feel so good I guess in the basket she had received a kettle and she already had a kettle so she paid it forward to a woman who didn't have Aww. it so it was that's I nice. have goosebumps, yeah. I, I, every time I get goosebumps. I get some chills yeah. too. That's really sweet. Now, what you people can do at home, our good friends uh, at Shaw TV here, are here with Darlene, and we're telling you guys, asking you guys to help out in any way you can. You can do it monetarily. You can do it with Canadian Tire money. Exactly. Which is excellent. And also by uh, donations of, of gifts. Ac yes, we have people dropping in um, and dropping off a, a monetary uh, donation. We have people bringing in a kettle. Some people can't commit to a full basket, so they'll bring in a few items and we just work it all in and make these great baskets. You don't have to wrap it. I will. I can do the wrapping. Correct. I've wrapped <laughs> a lot of baskets and we wrap them in cellophane and incorporate a list so that the ladies at the shelter can uh, match it up to the individual. And um, they just look amazing on uh, on November 29th when that's our wrap up date. It's amazing. Amazing. You see uh, people come and it's like an assembly line and we're loading up trucks and cars and vehicles for, for the shelters. Cool. Yeah. Well, we're really happy that we can help uh, you spread your message. And another way you can find out more information is going online. And there is a shopping list on there that you can find and, and uh, help out. And, and as you can see here, there's this lovely jar of Canadian Tire Money. So if you have Canadian Tire Money, and I know there are people out there that do collect it, then uh, definitely, what do they just come down to the office here? Absolutely. I have a big cookie jar at the, at the front. And they can drop it off. And they can give me a call at 623-5011. And um, we I, buy, I use this for uh, purchasing baskets for items. Oh, so, perfect. you know, we try to keep all the funds going in the right place. Stay tuned to Shaw TV. There's a lot more coming your way.